Today I'm going to make this super cute slimline card that features the Holiday Penguin stamp set from My Favorite Things. My name is Bug, this is Mediocre Arts and Crafts. Here I'm using Canson watercolor paper and Versa Fine Onyx Black ink. Versa Fine uh, will take watercolor without bleeding or smearing, so that's why I chose that one. The majority of this video is just me pretending like I know how to paint. I've got black paint here and I mixed in a little bit of blue to create some grayish highlights so that uh, there can be multiple shades in the black penguin parts. I tend to use watercolor almost like acrylic and make them opaque. I'm not sure why I do that and I'd like to maybe loosen up a little bit and get away from that but that's how it is. I don't always get to grab stamp sets when they're first issued but this is a um, new release from this season uh, in the fall of 2020. I really fell in love with these little penguins. As I was painting each one, I was thinking of names of famous trios that uh, I could call these little guys. So I got stuck on things like Mo, Larry, and Curly, and Peter, Paul, and Mary, and uh, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. So if you have a favorite trio that you think... Uh, my favorite trio, of course, is Crosby, Stills, and Nash. And if I'm figuring this out right, the little guy on the left-hand side is probably David Crosby. You know what they say, in every group of friends, there's always a this guy. And now that I think of it, in my group of friends, I just might be this guy. I like the color that I started out with for the tree here. It, um, it's a light green, but then I went back to do some darker green shading and I just got way out of control and the whole thing ended up dark green. But um, it turned out all right. I did mix up some white with a tiny, tiny bit of a bluish color to do the bodies of the penguins, and I'm not really sure if it shows up, but in the um, actual card it, it does a little bit. And here I am with the dark green. Next time I think I'm gonna start with the light green, do the entire thing, and just come in with, you know, the color of the bulbs uh, on top of it. Just a little darker. At the end of the day, I think this really would have been cute without the blue for the sky because I do like to leave some empty space. And here I 
created a card base out of this piece of designer card stock. I really like the way these greens uh, match the greens that are in the tree that I painted. But after mounting it, I realized that um, there was way too much green. So I went ahead and sliced it down and uh, put it on a white card base that you'll see in the very last still here. Then I chose my favorite sentiment from the Holiday Penguin stamp set. It says, you make every day jolly. And here's the final card. Thanks so much for watching.